This is Ocean by Ellen Villa. And as much as I have tried, it's just lackluster for me. This is Bernstein Rooted. It has that little tiny micro lace front. It's done really well. Let me show you how it looks really good. It looks almost like mine, my own natural one. But it isn't even as long as my finger. It's not even as long as my finger. It's so small. And then here's the side part. You can't even really see the monofilament side part. It's very, very small. It's very narrow and small too. It looks great. It's just so small. It's just very, very small. And as much as I try, it just can't get it like the manufacturer's photo. It just can't. I've tried. I, I've already done a review on it outside to see the Bernstein rooted. But this thing just keeps flipping back like that because of that little tiny little micro lace front. And this is about all it's going to be. nice thing is is that I've moved to the Central Valley where it is a hundred degrees in the shade and it's going to be getting hot in the car so I can wear it up and I can get my money's worth because I spent all the money on this um, I can sit here and play with it in front of you and make it look you know exciting and and great for 10 minutes but I'm gonna to have to keep playing with it there is permatease all throughout it, but it is very, very low. Like it is low density, hardly anything, which is probably why it doesn't look at all like the manufacturer's photo because nothing's keeping it up. It just, when I'm working all day and I'm looking down and I'm answering the phone, it just it gets straighter and straighter. And this is not what I want to look like. <laughs> so I was reading in the comments and a viewer said, you know, that looks a lot like Paula Young's Ashley. And I've been looking at dupes between these styles and Paula Young's styles, and I think she's kind of right. I think I think that the Ashley wig is not doesn't have this length right here, but if you put that in the back and you just have this right here, it does resemble Ashley quite a bit right here. Ashley has uh, doesn't have as long of a has longer bangs than this. This has kind of short bangs, and if I wanted to, and I might, you have to let me know if you would like to see me trim these up, because I wouldn't mind doing that. Because I'm going to start wearing this up with, in the summer. I have worn my heartthrob up to death. And now it's time to move on to a messy bun with Ocean so that I can get all of my money's worth out of it because it's just sitting in its box in my wig closet, which is my clothes, clothing closet. And I know that a messy bun isn't for everyone. I like it because I think a messy bun looks believable. <laughs> Pete's giving me the stink eye. What are you doing? <laughs> Twirling around. <laughs> so let me show you what This looks like next to Ashley. I'll try to be more gentle when I comb these out. It's not gonna matter anymore because once I put it up into a ponytail, it's gonna stay. Because this cap on the side is so funky. It's the only way I can describe it. That's the cap, you know? That's what you see when I flip the part. So while I like to wear it on the right, I can't. Because that is just a horrible getaway to be working you know, 
and have people looking at that. This is Ellen Villa. <laughs> and the price that I paid reflects that. So let me show you Ashley. This is a little bit longer here. But again, if you put this in the back, it's going to look like Ashley. So let me show you what I mean. All right. So let me see. Four fingers up. These bangs are quite a bit longer. I'll put it on the left. There is no monofilament features and there is no lace front. No lace front. No monofilament. The permatease on Ashley is very low. Very low. Drop my comb. Let's see. It does have that same look. But Ashley has wonderful permatease up here in the crown on the top here, where I can wiggle that, wiggle that, and get it to stand up and give me the height that I like so that it doesn't look so flat because I feel like sometimes I'll look in the mirror and think I look greasy because <laughs> it's shiny and it's plastic. But Ashley is just such as the sweetheart, I think, of the Paula Young line. It's just like a classic bob that has grown out. So if you're looking for that progression of maybe style, this color is SF 10 slash 26 number six. And I'll list that in the description, which reminds me of John Renault's Shaded Mocha. It really looks like John Renault Shaded Mocha, but these are heat friendly fibers. So they're going to wear a little differently, but it doesn't have that goofy flip off that, that Ocean has. And I can see would be cute just to pin back. to drive to the dog park or the grocery store or to pick up hair mail at the post office. Yeah. And probably even a little messy bun. I can't see the back, so I'm doing it blind, but even if some of this fell out, it would be cute. So, yeah, I can see, I can see the similarities. I can, I can, I like that. So if you were eyeing the ocean wig, I'm here to tell you, mine doesn't look anything like the picture. And I've tried, <laughs> I have tried. Uh, you can see uh, the other video that I posted of me trying. Um, and it's just because of it, I, I tried to do as much as I can in it and it just went back in the box. So um, this is a great little ear tucker. Be great and cute at work. Even a half up, half down. You can flip the part because it's just all um, open cap and has that permatease on it. So 
if you're like me and you like to part it on the right. You can fulfill that sensation of it's wrong because <laughs> I'm, I'm leaning on the right. I, I talk on the right. I do this on the right. <laughs> so anyway, thanks so much for watching. I'll talk soon.